Trevor Lorene from Green Bay is our Cooking With You guest this week. We're so happy to have you back on the show, Trevor. Thank you. Um, we're making some really flavorful recipes like this one. Tell me about what we're making here. Making ahi uh, tuna tacos on soft shell tacos. I'm making a, a cabbage lime jalapeno slaw. We're going to get the steak sizzling. You, mm. want, you want your pan hot when you put that in there because you want it to sizzle. Okay. The slaw is real simple. It's a little bit of uh, may or sour cream and mayonnaise and a lime. Love that smell of the lime. The lime really brings out everything because we're going to have some peppers in here too. So we're going to have sweet and tart and hot and it's really good. Fabulous. It's going to balance out that Nutella ice cream. Yeah, he made Nutella ice cream in the 7 o'clock hour. The best part is Trevor gave us the recipes to these. So those are online for you if you want to check it out. Yeah, um, the, the Nutella ice cream is, is relatively um, calorific <laughs> yeah. to be nice about it. But this is a, actually a very low meal. I mean, because a taco or a tuna is um, a low calorie fish. It's very healthy for you. What did you all add in there, real oh, quick? Oh, yeah, right. Maybe I should say that. Oh, that's okay. I put in uh, red jalapeno peppers, uh, lemon zest from a, or lime zest. Okay. Um, two scallion onions chopped up and um, some cilantro. Awesome. You got to have that. And then the last thing is, of course, the cabbage. Carefully measured at all times. <laughs> and then you just do this. And honestly, this is better if you make it the day in advance. Because with any, with any salad like this, you want to give the flavors a chance to like soften and blend. OK. So like I learned when I was a kid through the ma magic of television, Yep. I need my, I walked off camera. Oh, no. Hey, that's OK. You can walk off camera. Oh, yummy. So that takes about five minutes while we're, doing, while we're waiting for that to finish. Okay. And you want the tuna, you, know, so you want it to be a good kind medium rare. rare. Yeah. yeah. Uh, if you cook it all the way through, like I know some people like that, you will end up with tuna that is really dry and tough. And, and you don't want that. No, you don't. That kills the flavor. And you want to put your taco shells down before <laughs> you fill them. That would work to put them down before you fill them. There you go, Trevor. This is, this is demonstrating that you know, while I look like I'm a really cool pro, I'm not. Yes, you are. And you put the slaw in right there, looking great. And as you're putting that slaw in, as the tuna is cooking, let's bring up your blog, sure. Trevor, because I, I really like this. I like the message you're trying to get out there. Make your someday today. Tell me about your blog and the podcast that you have there, too. Well, the blog started uh, a couple years ago as a way of me to document the food I make and my journey beyond weight loss into maintenance. And the, it got to the point where the, the blog was fun, but I really wanted to reach more people. Yeah. So I started the podcast. And the podcast is, has a similar approach uh, where I interview people who have, are successful in business, art, um, artists, performers, athletes. I find out the challenges that they faced and then find out how they beat those challenges. Great. And I, I, my podcast is actually twice a week. On Mondays are the interviews, where I let the guests do all the talking. On Thursdays, I have what I call my trevatorials, where I take one bit of information that they brought forward, and I try to apply that to a lot of different goals that, that anybody might be experiencing. And it works. I've been getting a lot of downloads, a lot, a lot of listeners. I have um, guests from Greece, Israel, wow. Armenia, Canada, England, Scotland, Ireland. It's fun. Go check it out. We have it on our website. I'll take this off the burner. We'll get this cut up and put it on the taco as well. Recipes, like we said, are online. We'll show you the finished product. Then when we come back, Good Day Wisconsin, we'll be right back.